I don't yeah. quite understand that yeah. one, but yeah. you know, we'll get into it. Yeah. But you have a project coming soon mm -hmm. called the Sovereign, I believe. Yeah, Sovereign, which is basically like it's the King of Kings. Yeah, it's it's royalty. It's something I'm proclaiming to be the King of Halifax, and it, it's. You know where that came? I'm not one of these dudes. Like I woke up one day and was like, "I'm better than everybody. I'm yeah. this. I'm that." There was a there was maybe like a three month span where I just went to a bunch of shows, and I just talked to people. I didn't perform. Hmm. I went to a bunch of shows and I just talked to other rappers, and the respect that I got and the 100 percent. At the time, I had a new girlfriend at the time, and and she, even she was like, "Wow, like these guys like really respect you." You know what yeah. I mean? So I started to really. Think about my career and what I've done, and just kind of like I didn't do any writing. I was just like thinking about my career, and I was like, man, you know what? I feel like the king of Alphax, and then it just happened, and just, I ran with it. And uh, basically, yeah, that's where the sovereign came in. Is uh, is that a little bit like? Let me ask you a question here. In a way, by claiming that, mm -hmm. I feel like you're also invigorating. It's almost like. Should prove me I'm not. Yeah. Like it's almost oh, like, it's almost a good thing for younger like, yeah. I don't mean necessarily age or whatever, but just you know <clears throat> Yeah. Less experienced rappers to 100%. kind of be like kinda of like what Kendrick did with control, yeah. where it's I still exact. think that was a great like come yeah. on, come on gentlemen, we gotta step yeah. it up here. Well if you come get if me. anyone saw me after this three month period or whatever it was of talking to these rappers, when I finally said I'm gonna run with this, if anybody saw me perform in the next oh, three months after, I, I did the hopscotch cipher. I did. You did uh, the boost sessions boost, with IV, yeah. and I just. I'm telling everybody. You were crowned. I'm the on king, and shows, yeah, I'm like, just like. So that's the tip of mine. Like, and if you hear most of my album, like, you know, it's it's that tip. I'm right. just telling you, and I'm not trying to say. Here's the thing. I'm not saying I'm not Mayweather and everybody, and saying like I'm better than Muhammad Ali. I if I sat down and had to write a list of, uh, like the best lyricists in Halifax, I'm not going to be that guy. In my in, in my head, but head. right, but I could still be the king and say that. I'm not saying I'm better than everybody at every facet of hip hop. What I'm saying is I'm the king because if you watch any, if you read history books, if you re watch any movies that have like uh, you know real just dope kings, like someone that you f follow that connects with you, that guy struggled to get where he is, and that's, that's what I've done. So my body of work, my 15, 16 years in the in the game. My nine, well, this will be my ninth album. So my eight albums prior put me to where I am right now, and that's why I'm saying I'm the king. I'm not saying I'm the king. If you ask me, I, c I could probably name a few rappers off the top of my head that I, th if I listen to them, I think they're better than me, lyrically or whatnot, but they haven't done what I've done as far as sure. a body of work. Sure.